No, this is your clutch. I know where the clutch is. Right, do you want me to show you how to do this or not? Yes, but I know where the clutch is. Okay, fine. All right, you do it yourself, okay? Fine. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? You can't park here. Uh, I'm just here to pick it's up Sarah. It's private property. Now turn around, get the hell out of here. Come on. Okay. Move it. Yep. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay, uh, you know what, though? I think I'm just gonna wait right here. You can go back to doing your guard the cornfields thing. This is Officer Moore at the gate. We got an issue here. Hey, listen, asshole, this is a restricted area. I told you, get the hell out of here. Hey, hey, you just wait right there. I told you, move it. It's like I was trying to say, I'm just here you to pick up... Did you not see that sign? Oh, look at that. That's kind of hard to miss. I'm authorized to use deadly force. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Hey, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, what's going on? <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Whitaker. It's, it's what, fine, I, Do you know this asshole? Yeah, he's with me. He's with me. Sorry, ma'am. I, I didn't know go. that... It's fine. Honestly, I apologize. Shh. Oh, and Jim... Deacon. I'm not with her. She's with me. Hold on tight. Why do you always do that? Do what? Act like such a dick. Oh, come on. He started it. What are you, five? Hey, watch the clutch. Remember, you gotta give it enough gas, rev up the RPMs. I got this. Yeah, I can hear. Where are we headed? Over to the dam. That's a nice, quiet road, right? Were you driving? No. Are we still going out tonight? You said something might come up. Uh, crap, yeah. Uh, Boozer and the boys want to ride down to Klamath State, visit Jack. So you're gonna blow me off to go see some guy in prison? Jack's not some guy. I know, I know. I was kidding. Oh shit, look out! Oh, shit. oh god. Oh my god. But every time I'm on a bike with you, some idiot in a truck tries to run us off the road. Oh, my God. No, no, no. no. Listen, listen, listen. You did great. You did great. Uh, most people, they would have panicked. They would have oversteered, and that would have gotten us killed. I almost did get us killed. I was... No, no. I wasn't paying attention, and I was distracted. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just breathe. You're okay. Wait a second. What did, what did you mean, distracted? No, it's just stuff going on at work. It's nothing. I just... Oh. Okay. Oh. I just thought maybe you uh, saw my new patch. Here No. Nomad? Wait, you, you quit the club? No, I didn't quit the club. I would never quit the club. Uh, uh, nomad, what it means is, um, well, I'll be less involved from now on. Deke, I didn't ask you to do that. Oh, I know, I know. And if you had, I would have said no. <laughs> you ready to try this again? Yeah. I mean, no, but yeah, I will. Thank you for saving my life. <laughs> well, you know, I do what I can. Hey, hey, the clutch, the clutch. I know what the clutch is. Okay, uh, the... Deacon. So, uh, do you think your parents are gonna come? To the wedding? I don't know. I mean, you know, I, I thought if I stepped back from the MC that, uh... I don't think it's gonna matter to them, Deacon. But you're gonna, you're gonna at least tell them. Yeah, if you want me to. Look, it's just... I'm not going to change who I am and who you are to make my uptight, middle-class parents happy. Okay. Look out! I see them. Hey, are they, are they headed to your work? Oh, shit. What about the MC? Are any of them coming now that you've gone Nomad? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh... It's probably been a while since any of them set foot in a chapel, uh, and you really want 27 Harleys rolling up in that little church in Marion Forks? Yeah. You know what? As a matter of fact, 
night too. Uh, okay. What's going on? I don't know. Miss Whitaker. Yeah. She's been trying to get a hold of you, says it's urgent. It's always urgent. Let him know I'll be right there. Okay. I gotta go. Hey, hey. <sighs> Sorry. It's fine. It's probably just a fire alarm or something small. Okay. Knock him dead. <clears throat> Love you. Um, just call me later. Addie, I'm sorry. Whatever. Addie, whatever, Ricky. I'm sorry. God damn. Clearance. Clearance. Uh, O'Brien, this is St. John. Come back. O'Brien, this is St. Just answer your goddamn radio. St. John, didn't think I'd hear from you again. Yeah, neither did I. All right, listen, that night you bugged out. You told me that you didn't take any civilians. You just took uh, Nero personnel, feds, people with clearance. I told Shut up, shut up, shut up. Listen to me. Sarah, my wife, she had clearance. She had her ID badge with her the night that I put her on your chopper. So just do me a favor, look it up. Sarah Irene Whitaker. She worked at Cloverdale. She had federal clearance. She was doing, uh, I don't know, research, pharmaceutical. I don't know what she, the hell she was okay, doing. Just okay. do me. I'll see what I can find. Okay, great. Well, Brian, remember, you owe me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Brian out. So what the hell? I managed to recruit a few guys who I trust to let me aren't happy with what's going on. So why am I here? I wanted to give you this. You were right about your wife. How did you get this? When Silver Lake evacuated, they took Nero personnel, federal officials, and well, Sarah Irene Whitaker had a class four federal clearance level. Clearance level. The wife bugged out with a recon unit east of Fort Roth. Take me there. No. No. Well, you got a ride. We're all friends now. The base is gone. What? A year ago. Local militia group. Militia group? Where's their camp? We don't know. How the hell can you not know? You got a helicopter. You got satellites. Somewhere around Crater Lake, but it's a no-fly zone, okay? They got outposts, rockets, RPGs. Crater Lake. Crater Lake. I wanted to tell you about the work we're doing. Studying the infected, the freaks. They're evolving. As bad as things are right now, they're gonna get worse. A lot worse. I got a use for you. I go to hell, O'Brien. I don't give a shit about any of that. Boozer! Booze man, come back! Yeah, Dean. Hey, listen, listen to me. Uh, a year ago, we were with Iron Mike. We were thinking about riding south. Santium Pass was blocked. There was no way through, and he said that he knew another way. Iron Mike was wild to have with this Listen to me, listen to me. Remember what he said. About the trail the miles, and there was a, a trail that went around Mount Thiels. Thiels, I don't know, Thielsen, Thielsen, yeah, that's it. Thielsen, the pass. Yeah, why the hell you Her ID badge. Yeah. Boozer, uh, 
Her. I don't know, uh, but God, if there's even a chance that she's alive, I well, I gotta find her. Goddamn right. Uh, shit, I, I gotta go. Uh, Ricky and Addie need need help putting up a shelf or some goddamn thing. Look, I, I'll see you when you get back to me. Yeah, yeah. Who's her? Up? Okay, okay. See you. Yeah. He, uh, let, let's say the Swarmers had other ideas about that. Oh, shit. Ricky didn't tell me that. Mark wasn't the kind of man you ever turned your back to, but he didn't deserve to go out like that. Uh, psh, I guess not. Uh, but then I guess Dan Lane didn't deserve to get shot in the back either. Some shit I gotta take care of. Are you coming back? I'm not coming back. What, what do you what do you mean? Boozer told us. Oh, she told you. Okay, look, there's nothing to tell. There's no way over the Sanium Pass, you know. I know. Let him in. Yes, yes, I'm coming back. Listen, like I said, I got some shit to do. Deacon out. Alright, let's see what the old man's got to say. You know, way over the Tielson Pass. You told me once that I I'd... told you nothing. Go on. Oh, I can't on. help you, Deke. Just draw me a goddamn map. After everything you've done. After everything that I've. What about what you've done, old man? Huh? Sherman's you camp. The things that you, you get out of here. Listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. What if you could take it all back? Huh? What if you could fix it? After I put Sarah on a chopper, I felt relieved. How fucked up is that? Uh, I was relieved. Mike, that's what I've been living with. And now you're chasing ghosts. You think finding your old lady, if she's alive, you think that's gonna fix it? Make you whole? I don't know, but I gotta try. All right. If I do this, what you want, show you the way over the pass. You don't come back. All right, you promised me you don't come back. I got gotcha. you. Holy shit. Those are right, I. Uh -huh. huh. Last winter. We were up on Farewell Ridge. We were watching the freaks. Thousands, thousands of them. I mean, too many to count. Yeah, I remember. All I could think was every one of us, man, woman, and child, are now homeless. A bunch of goddamn refugees. Yeah. What belongs to them now? We'll survive. Yeah, we've been doing that all right. Surviving. Isn't living. <laughs> Something Jack used to say. Doesn't matter when you hit the road where you're heading out to, but you damn well better know where you're coming home to. You know, we never talked about it. While we still wore the colors all this time out in the freak show and shit like this didn't matter anymore. Yeah, yeah but I think. Last two Mongols on Earth, farewell originals. Uh, the biker boys, most badass drifters on the broken road. Damn straight. Yeah, I guess we did become sort of a brand. The, we were a lot of things, but we were never a brand. <laughs> <laughs> we rode a 
not a farewell without Sarah, without Jack or anyone. I knew that we were leaving everything behind. Everything that mattered was gone. Said this. You're a nomad again, huh? Yep, I guess I am. Come on, Jack. Inside, let's go. If she's out there, you'll find her. Hey. Our big Mike is taking you over the pass? Yep. You really think she's still alive? Billions of people are dead, but somehow she made it. Hey, we made it, didn't we? If I give up now, if I don't, if I don't do this, now then I'm just gonna end up like, uh... Like us, right? Like Iron Mike, like Boozer? What'd you call us? Campers, yeah? You go, and you find your woman. You know where to find me. You know what? You know what I think, Deacon? I think that you're you're afraid to be here. You're afraid to be a part of something. We need you here, and that scares the hell out of you. I'm sorry. <sighs> yeah, me too. You ready? Yeah, I want to get the hell out of here. Come on, this way. Okay, I'm following you. Jack out fishing once, before, you know. Oh shit. I got one. I didn't know what the hell to do with it. That sounds like Jack. Oh, you ran a pretty tight club. Or you boys raised some hell back in the day. I don't think you murdered anyone. Not in cold blood. It's not murder if they shoot at you first. Tourists we used to get through here come summer? A few. Thousands. Too many to count. Highway be bumper to bumper with SUVs and campers chock full of sunburned moms, beer chugging dads, and their snot nosed kids. Goddamn rainbow, floppy hats, Hawaiian shirts, and flippy flops. All summer long they come. A trail of colorful ants from LA to farewell to here. Nonstop. Glad I avoided road trips out here that time of year.
use the help. I don't have a choice. Fair enough. Come on, just follow me. Yeah, okay. This is as far as I go. Keep following the trail. It'll take you down the mountain, on into the Diamond Lake Valley. I wish you luck. Hope you're right about your old lady still being alive. She is. Well, maybe so. But you gotta ask yourself, Deke. What does it matter if everyone else is dead? You're out there. I'll find you.
ammo left. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. I don't know what we would have done without you, man. Oh, come on. Hey, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. It's dead. It's cool. Man of the hour. Oh, God. I'm Russell. Glenn Russell. This is Private Mullins. Rick. Hey, Rick. Uh, I'm Deacon St. John. Did, did you say private? Yeah. Yes, sir. The Shoots County Militia. You're not from around here. You come over the pass? Uh, no, no, no. I've just been uh, drifting. I came over the uh, salt flats east of Silver Lake. <laughs> what? What the hell are you doing out here, man? How'd you get across the 97? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus, man. What? This guy just saved your freaking life. The colonel told us to look out for anybody entering the territory, north or south. <laughs> freaking slow your roll, man. We'll let the captain deal with that, okay? Fine. He just killed a freaking ranger, dude. Come with us. We got a camp just by Diamond Lake. Get you three hots in a cot. Least we can do. Okay, yeah, sounds good. What about Flores? We can't just leave him here. Uh, you stay here. I'll come back with some fuel. No! Listen, stay here. Use his ammo if you gotta. You'll be fine. Okay? Following you. 